This guy, let me end this shit right Yeah, here. I was going to ask this about guy, that call. I love this. Yeah. Shit. The yeah. one call. The phone call. I was going to be like, where were you when Five was like, Joe, I did it. And I'm going to sign math. Mm. <laughs> I love Five Mike. And Five Mike's, all right, we all spirits. You mm -hmm. ever see when the plane about to crash, they be like, we have 241 souls. <laughs> this body, shit, flesh. Oh, dog, I'm one fly, handsome nigga. Don't do that to yourself. <laughs> Let's go. You can't be like me. No Botox, none of that shit. Just a fly nigga. You know that shit. Now, <laughs> and so we all about energy and mm -hmm. souls and spirits. And I've been watching them for a long time. And I said, I like this guy. Minding my business. Used to see him places or whatever. If he said, what's up, I said, what's up? You know, and I'd be like, I like this guy right here. <clears throat> right? And then um, he started doing his music and all that. And so I called him and I said, yo, Five Mike, let me tell you something. I said, if it ain't for the music, if it ain't for nothing else, Nigga, you gonna blow from something. Why? You got that thing. You got that energy about you. You got that shit, man, that we like, that we wanna be a part of. You know what I'm saying? And he was like, yo, but crack, yo, you don't understand what this means. I'm telling you, five. <laughs> you got something. And because, and you really need to listen to this, people don't wanna work. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's a fact. Jesus Christ. That's a fact. It's the bar of the whole show. It's the Bible right here. Jesus Christ. Lord, my whole life. People don't want to work. And so if you're about success, if you're about winning, and you're a hard worker, you notice the niggas that work. And so five is doing this on the Instagram. But I don't care if you don't like it. He's working. Word. Mm -hmm. And right. so you look at him and say, oh, I like this. This guy works. He's a fucking worker. Sooner or later, he's going to hit some shit out of the park. He's going to step on some shit. He's going to do something. He's going to get up out of here. And we're going to be like, yo, this nigga. Five, I don't know his TV five, show. I, yeah. I don't know what it is. Right. Five Mike is destined to be some shit. Right. Thank and you, so... From what I see from him, this is a beautiful spirit, beautiful energy. Um, and, and I love to support that, right? And so what people don't understand, and so what's, what's sad, and I don't want to preach too, we don't preach too much today, but what's sad about the black community and the Spanish community is we want it all. Mm. A lot of us just want to be the only one. Mm. That's the mistake. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, you just want to be me, me, me. Remember when you was a kid, you're my boy, my boy. You can't play with my ball. Right. And so you want to be the Trash. only one. But there's no strength in that. Trash. So because if Fat Joe fall off, who going to take up? Mm -hmm. Are we going to tell a story about how we had it? Mm. That's not impressive to me. And so when these guys who had it before, that don't, they had a run. A lot of niggas we know had a run and they don't got it no more. Big them up for doing that in this lifetime. But, and we respect them. But I don't want to hear about who had it. I want to have it now. No. Yeah. And the way that happens is everybody wins. And so if I need help, yo, Khaled, could you help? I never had to. Yo, Ram, could you? Yo, this. They all know I'm a phone call away. Yo, Joe. And so that's how you build strength. Right. Everybody got to win. Everybody you don't got to be jealous of niggas, especially niggas that look like you. Thanks. Everybody got to win. I see you doing a good thing here, man. I've been invited three times and with no disrespect to the shop with LeBron and them. Unfortunately, I missed. They probably never going to invite me again. <laughs> I missed it three times. Mm. And I want to do the show. I love LeBron. Right. I worship him. Worship. And so, I, but when I see y'all sit, I got to sit there. You want to know why? Just like they don't say Fat Joe's one of the greatest of all time or whatever the case may be. When Fat Joe do something, 
<laughs> they follow suit. Nigga. Come on, man. And they're going to come up in here. The biggest on earth is going to come up in here and be like, let me talk my <laughs> shit. shit. Uh, uh, no, I, I want to say one thing. Um, yeah, I've been doing this music thing for like 20 years, like behind the scenes, running around, everything. Um, I've never been this big. <laughs> <laughs> My song with Mac Joe has been on the radio since the day I put it out. New New York. It's Let's been on go. the radio since Let's I put it go. out. You know what I mean? So um, I told Joe this whole time, um, you changed my life. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> One feature. I got, I, got, I got songs with everybody. Sometimes. The song with Fat Joe is, is Let me is tell you different. something. Yeah. Let me tell you something. No disrespect to five mics. There's something called ignorance is bliss. Mm. And so you remember the guy, the cartoon, where the nigga would fall off the building and land on the school bus, <laughs> and he'll fall on a pot of water and this and that, uh -huh. but somehow he never gets hurt. Right. You remember that com the cartoon back in the day? Yeah, just keep walking. Mr. Magoo and then or something, some yeah, shit. Nah, where the nigga walk, paper. flip, airplane, or yeah, whatever. Right. Shit right. happening all around. My brother was like that. God bless my brother. He, he still there, the money man. Um, niggas would be shooting at each other and he'd be out there and never saw the niggas shoot at each other. And he in the middle of the shit that's flying over and he'd be like, hey, who got the beer? Like, he don't know what's going mm -hmm. on. Right. right? And so, Five Mike's got such a rich spirit and soul about him that he don't even know how he's popping that way. <laughs> <laughs> he just go. <laughs> just go. And it's dope as shit yeah. in the world. You yeah, get this thing, I be bugging. Yo, you know what we be doing? The other day we was on the plane. We had all the white people on the plane going, five? Whoa. Five. I'm sitting here. <laughs> Uncle Dan sitting here. Rich Flay is sitting. We in the first class and we keep going, five? <laughs> These white people don't even know what the fuck is going on. They start screaming, five? <laughs> five? White <laughs> ladies, don't you five? And so, Let's go. Wow. I don't know what it is. I believe he's gonna blow. But I don't know if it's a TV it's God, show. Though, Joe. I don't know if it's of course God. it's God. God, God most high. Clap it up. You got a great That's show. That's what it is. That's it. That's what it is. New New York. Out oh. right now. Yes. Can knock the hustle. Out right now. Matt Pop is on Can Knock the Hustle, the first record with Fat Joe. Mickey D's. Go check that out. What's up with Mickey D's? Mickey D's video on the way, man. And matter of fact, McDonald's just might cut the check after this episode. We went to Big. Yo, but what about what about Cuz? What's the hook, Cuz song? Oh, we, we outside. outside. I'm outside, yeah, I'm Who's outside. Here? I'm Yo, outside. Come here, son. Come here, son. Come, come here. Son. Come be, be seen. You gotta get some facts. Facts. <laughs> no, cuz. This is my cousin Tory. <laughs> Team McKnight. He on that outside hook featuring Joel Santana. Shit is fire. Now I appreciate you for even playing it. Thank you so much. His career started yeah, last week. He has a hit record. He has a hit record already. Shout out to Tory. Is that your first song? First song ever. <laughs> <laughs> my cousin told me that you were gonna It is though. It is. I told him. I was like, yo, this thing. Shout out to Joel Santana. I'm going to Some people don't. Uh, man. That's so all good. That's I'm going to tell you what. I love to appreciate you, for real. Like on a whole nother level. Because um, it's two people. You know, T.I. gets a different seat with me. Right. But there's two people that really in the culture of hip hop in New York City, like out of the OGs, you really need to get saluted for participating and pushing other people. That's a fact. Like, the number one thing is, like you said, when they get that me, me, me. That's hip hop. Everybody want to be the, the only person. So for somebody gotta, to step I down, it's to totally you at crazy. At this point, it's not so much about money, right? It's at this point, when Fat Joe got to do something because he like you, out of respect. Facts. There you go. And Fat. that's it. That's the only way to get Fat Joe to move somewhere now is because he respect you, he got love, and he want to see you win. And so same thing with Jim Jones. Jim the Hustler, he been doing this. He co-signs you too. Because people love your spirit. You know what I'm saying? You're a great person. Thank you, bro. You know, and so we fuck with you. And we want you to win. And we will laugh. You come out and have a hit movie, hit TV show, hit some. We're gonna laugh. <laughs> so much. We're God. gonna scream TV five. Show. So loud. <laughs> we don't give we a fuck. We got a TV show coming up. This is like yeah. about that's two not, weeks. That's not but Joe, you got a show coming out. I got um.
Breaking news. Okay. I'm about breaking to say, like, which one can you tell us? Hi. Um, this episode is crazy. Yeah, it's too crazy. <laughs> nah, it's too crazy. So every Sunday, eventually every Sunday after you watch BMF and Power, you're going to see the Fat Joe show. Oh, my God. On Stars Network. The number one show. <laughs> the number one. <laughs> Listen. It's a lot of Whoa. TV. It was a lot of channels trying to get this shit. Puff wow. is my partner, and we chose there because that's prime time every Sunday. And so I can't tell you no more. I already broke the news. Nobody ever Fire. heard that. Wow. Right. 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 Clap right. it up. Clap right. it up. Clap right. it up, man. Right. Right. Jesus. Clap it up. Clap it up. What an episode. But yo, I got to request a fat Joe, though. Next time you get a commercial or something, Shoot it up in here so we can get the background. <laughs> 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 you know what I'm talking about? My money, too. <laughs> Yo, so so listen, let me tell you something, me. man. Right about now, there should be, and I don't want to sound like crazy people, but there should be a barber company, the, the, the cream, the club men should oh, yeah. be paying something. Yeah. The cool care should be paying something. Yep. The powder nigga should be paying something. The clippers need to pay. The this, you want to get the money, Fat Joe will teach you how right, to get the money. let's get it. Let's right get now, it. while you're here, we got to get in touch with whoever owns the hammer spray, whoever <laughs> no, owns the powder, all that. Whoever, all that. and they shit need to be behind you like this. Follow me with the camera, bro. Don't sleep. <laughs> let's you go. see this shit? Club Man Powder. Let's go. For the show. The Shave Gel Tomb 40. All these guys got to pay. Facts. Otherwise, we can't put them on the screen. Right. And big. right now, the too biggest big. shit is social media, YouTube, IG, everything. Product placement. Product placement. You need all that shit. Sponsorship. We need to get Advertising. money. Advertising. That's why I take the label off my water. It's, gonna it's, it's, com it's coming, Joe. It's coming. It's, it's, it's in yeah. the works. It's coming. It's in the works. I know it's coming. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. <laughs> See, let me explain something to you. Why, why are you like that? <laughs> you told me before we even started. <laughs> I told right. you before we started, but let me, ex let me explain something to you, and I'm going to end the legacy talk yeah. with this. People think Fat Joe's biggest asset in hip hop is picking beats. Some people will say, yo, he picked the best beats. Him and Ross know how to pick the best beats. Some people say, yo, this nigga got anthems, making rains, lean backs all the way up. It's big motherfuckers, right? Mm -hmm. This guy knows how to make hits. Fat Joe's true talent is having an eye for talent. Mm. Fat Joe knows who's gonna win and he's never wrong. Mm. And so if Fat Joe sat in this motherfucking seat, you are gonna fucking win. Remember I told you that. Whoa. Okay? You gonna Whoa. fucking no, I'm win. I'm definitely gonna make I'm the phone call. <laughs> no, 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 she can't be the only one clapping today. Clap. No, yeah, yeah. clap, clap, clap. clap. Yeah, 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 yeah. We, we was just taking it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had to take that in place. Everybody's imagination just went to the back. Yeah. Like, oh, shit. Yeah, it's going to happen. Time Being that this is a five hour interview, I'll let you close. <laughs> Listen. Because I got rap beef with everybody now. I don't know the, half the shit I was talking here. Everything's smooth. They say it went on. Um, When, an, when our elders pass, we lose a library. Mm. Mm. So these moments, we have to cherish them, especially with someone who has so much knowledge and has been hands-on in the culture. Respect to you for just stepping foot in shot. Thank you. You could have came in and said, yo, I like what you're doing, shook my hand and walked out and I would have been like, yo, Fat Joe came with a shot. Yo, that would have been the that first 15 have, minutes of the show. That wouldn't have been hip hop. Mm, that wouldn't have been Fat Joe. Well, it wouldn't have been hip hop. Because you got to understand, we have a culture to protect. Yeah, man. This is a motherfucking culture. This is a religion, nigga. Hip hop is a whole different thing. We live, breathe, eat this shit. That's a fact. And when I see you doing everything and then you do the K Slate shit and I see how y'all held it down, I said, oh, no. I cannot, you know how when niggas so they, they act like they don't see it? Yeah, you know how when they say staying yeah. silent? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Staying silent is just as bad as, I don't want to make references to, you know, we respect Black Lives Matter and everything that's going on in social justice, but as hip hop culture, seeing something so dope 
talking about real hip hop, preserving the culture, and staying silent, it's a no. disrespect. So I had to come up in here as, as hip hop, a hip hop ambassador and say, yo, this is what it Damn. is, nigga. Wow. And guess what? I love everybody making money and everybody doing the same thing. Everybody got a different lens. Everybody tell a story a different way. So I'm just saying, yo, we all eating. Y'all might as well eat. And if I can help it by sitting in the hot seat, I'm going to do that because I respect your integrity and what you bring into the game. Wow. That's what has to be done. That's what was done to me. That's what Diamond D did for me. That's what Lord Finesse did for me. That's what Showbiz AG, AG did for me. Big L did for me. OC. OC. My OG. Buck Wow. OC, my God. And so Mush. they did that for me. Wow. You know what I'm saying? And so that's where I come from. I come from us building each other up. That's what it's all about. Building each other up. What's up? And so y'all doing something great here. Um, and I applaud it, man. And, and I you. hope you get big, 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 big on another level. And you will. Thank You're already you. there, bro. Here we go. Thank you. Well, no doubt. That's we it? Out. Wow. It's hot for trap trapper turn smack rapper. Only smack rapper that you know is smack rappers. Got bars I can hang with the backpackers. Trap star, I don't hang with the backpackers. I'm in the hood with the work you heard. Making fiends leave earth you heard. Got your baby mama thirst you heard. Feel the flow, nigga, throw it in reverse. This the way you need to surf you heard.